In this video, we look at getting started with an Adreno. I'm going to navigate to adreno.cc, and on this page, we'll take the drop down menu and go to software and downloads. On the downloads page, I'm going to download the Adreno IDE, and I'm on the Mac, so I will take that one and I'm going to download it. Then with the downloads directory, I will unzip it and that will give me the application. We'll launch the IDE and it gives us a simple sketch. Next, we'll connect our Adreno to a computer. I have a cable and a USB extension. Plug in one end of the USB to the computer, plug the other end into the Adreno. And then I will identify the board as a Mega 2560, the processor, and then for the port I will select USB device. Then I can upload that to the device and I have something now running. That is the bare minimum. You'll notice there's a setup method and a loop method, neither of which have any code. Let's go to something a little bit more interesting. Under examples, basic, let's go to Blink. Blink is a file, an application, that during the setup it specifies to use a pin, the LED built in. For an output, it writes to that pin a high voltage and then waits one second and then writes a low voltage. So we can execute that and once that's executed, we can see that there's a light blinking on our device. If we'd like to have it blink faster, we can say go every 250 milliseconds. Then try uploading that. Compiles, uploads, and now we see that our light is blinking more quickly. The Adreno also has a, a simple serial monitor that's available. I'm going to set the baud to the maximum, 2 million. And then during the setup process, I'm going to say serial.begin and give as the argument the speed. And then we will do a print line of hello world. And then try running that we have something that shows on the screen. I can clear the output, try uploading it again, and we get our output. Another thing we can do without sending the code over again is we can press the reset button. And with the reset button, it starts over. There you have an initial start at writing a program with the Adreno.